I like to start these updates in slightly different places when I can and today I'm out in the garage for good reason because probably the most that has changed since I last spoke to you has happened here. We have a floor down, we have a garage door as well which is very exciting. This is where we can park our cars now and perhaps slightly unusually this is where the MVHR will be housed. Normally you'd want it within the internal envelope, but when we were designing the house, the utility room was something that just ended up being a little bit small and without completely redesigning everything, we spoke to Alan Clark, who's a very experienced um, M&E engineer, and he said it will be fine in the garage, the systems are really good these days, and the risk that a lot of people see is condensation, if something goes wrong, you get condensation so that's why you normally keep it inside so yeah all of that work is progressing and I imagine soon we'll be commissioning the MVHR the other thing is quite a big win for us we've had two shipping containers on site and we've managed to sell those I think 1,100 pounds each which is brilliant it's extra money and it all counts at this stage when you're getting towards the end of the project landscaping looking pretty good driveway nothing will happen until right at the very end now just to put down the final shingle surface or whatever the name of the stones are should we head inside so let's head into the main living space first of all and hopefully what you will notice straight away from the last video is that all the second fix electrics have been completed and we've got lampshades up and it does make a big difference have a look in here we've got these feature lights hanging above the cooking area that are looking great and I think what will finish it off will be the tiling which I think is the last thing to take place in here we've got some blue tiles very expensive tiles but actually the base unit for the kitchen is quite cheap so we're hoping we've been clever with accessorizing one issue that we've still got is with the water and we've got it all booked in but the water company messed up the first time so we've got that date in the diary and please can they make it work because we've given in notice on our rental property so we want to be moving in so yeah we've got all the plumbing otherwise sorted out ready to go all the little extra fixtures and fittings such as loo roll holders they're all in place this is probably the last thing to show you and it's the hot water cylinder all plumbed ready to go for the house yeah, i just think in future updates there's not a massive amount more to show you but it will probably be commissioning of the mvhr that is quite interesting um, and i'm gonna finish off by just showing you that landscaping again upstairs from the first floor see you next time